dollars and so now i'm going to go back on over that would typically be on a form 1040 box number one interest income if any box is populated that's a little bit confusing then of course you can go to the instructions find this form on the irs website or if you have access to it with your data input look at the instructions part of it if i go back to the form 1040 you'll note that the schedule b is not highlighted because the the uh it's not over the dollar amount to have to add the second schedule so just to realize there's with these other schedules normally if you were going to make this from scratch and make up the forms you would probably like we did here say i'm going to have all the income pull into one line item on the first page and everything else be on a separate form like the schedule b in our case i put it over here so let's add another income line item we had w2 income and now i'm just going to pull the total down and add interest income here and this would be pulling in similar to like a schedule b we could make a whole nother schedule for uh interest and dividend income or we can basically i'm going to put it on one worksheet this time for now at least interest interest income so i'm going to highlight this home tab font group let's make it black and white and then i'll leave some space for multiple institutions let's go down to like well, let's do it down to here make that i'm going to make it blue and bordered i'm going to move this down a bit further 